Located in the eastern flanks of Tashigang Zongkok, Merak is a highland settlement inhabited by semi-nomadic community known as Brokpas. The people of Merak follow the age-old practice of migration, moving to pasture lands in lower altitudes along with their yaks and cattle during the harsh winters. Many Brokpas of Merak migrate to the winter pasture Cherbuling south of Merak. Cherbuling is a quaint settlement of 95 families surrounded by green vegetation and pasture land. It falls under Sakten Wildlife Sanctuary. For most part of the fall and winter, the highlanders stay here rearing yaks and cattle and return to higher altitudes with the onset of spring. Over the years, excessive grazing and felling of trees and bamboos for roofing and firewood have taken a toll on the forest and natural environment. Brokpas extracted large quantities of fuel wood for cooking and to warm their homes every winter. They also used bamboos to build their houses, which had to be replaced every few years. Huge dependence and over-extraction of natural resources have manifested in soil erosion and degradation of pasture land. In fact, vast swathes of rangelands have been lost to soil erosion, reducing the already scarce natural pasture available besides causing flash floods downstream. In order to prevent further degradation of pasture land and to conserve the environment for sustainable livelihood, the Global Environment Facility Small Grants Program, UNDP Bataan, and Comdex of Satoyama Initiative supported Cherbuling Rangeland Management Group in carrying out Cherbuling Rangeland Management Project. Technical support was provided by Chashigang Zongkak Administration and Gyok Livestock Office of Mira. To reduce the community's dependence on forest resources for roofing and firewood, the project provided corrugated galvanized iron CGI sheets for roofing their semi-permanent houses and fuel wood efficient heating ovens Bukhari to 95 families in Cherbuling. This has significantly reduced dependence on bamboo for roofing by about 80%, improving the food availability of red panda and other wild animals and the health of the environment. This has also improved the living standards of the families. Bukhari supplied on a cost-sharing basis has reduced fuel wood consumption by about 50%. It has also drastically improved the health of women and children as they are not exposed to indoor smoke as before. <laughs> Rong Environmental degradation had also led to drying up of water sources. The project therefore initiated water source protection to provide safe drinking water to the highlanders of Cherbuling. As part of this activity, seven water sources were fenced and protected, and new water tanks were also built.
The project also carried out sustainable pastureland management through construction of numerous check dams and restoration of barren land by creating buffer, fencing the area and tree plantation. The Highlanders have significantly benefited from the project and reduced their dependence on natural resources. In addition to electricity provided by the government, now they have access to Pukharis to keep the home warm and CGI roofs over their heads. Through the involvement in the project, the Highlanders have come to understand the importance of natural environment and they have now become champions of environmental conservation. <laughs>